everyone, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I am going to be unboxing a nice haul I got from Twisted Lily. Also, if you guys are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button. It helps me a ton. Okay, so I just wanted to show you guys as I'm unboxing this, the packaging in here, it's good. Like they made sure nothing was gonna get broken. So I really appreciate that. I ordered some really nice stuff. I am also going to be filming a separate video showing you guys like putting this stuff together. So I got handmade candles. So these are sets that you actually have to put together yourself. I just thought they were really, really cool. And I was like, hopefully they smell good. The sets were just so cute. And it says on the box, handmade concrete, homewares and candles created with love in Sydney, Australia. And this is the DIY scented candle kit. It's a 100% natural soy candle in a handcrafted concrete vessel. This one is bergamot, vanilla, mint, and lemongrass. So the top notes are are bergamot, peppermint, and lemongrass. The middle notes are clary, sage, aniseed, and vanilla. And then the base notes are cedarwood, helotrope. It has a 50 plus hour burn time and it is 12 ounces or 340 grams. As I open this up, this is what the set looks like. So cute. We have in here our 100% natural soy wax. It came in a cute little bag that is recyclable. Our fragrance oil, and this is the bergamot, vanilla, mint, and lemongrass. And then I believe these are the wicks that you put inside the candle in the center. And then we have our ceramic mug that we put the candle in. And it comes with little thingies so that it doesn't scuff up the table that you put it on. And overall, I think it's so cute. I cannot wait to put this together myself. So I will be filming a separate video showing you guys how I put everything together and how to make this candle. So stay tuned for that video. I also picked up a second. DIY candle. This is the Native Australian Florals and Wild Honey. It's got lemon, eucalyptus, and honey as the top notes. The middle notes are rose, lemon, myrtle, and sage. And then the base note is sandalwood, patchouli, and borinia. And then also it does come with this little card to tell you how to make the candle and gives you all the instructions I forgot to show you guys from the other box. So same concept with this box. The main difference is obviously the fragrance oil, different notes, and the vessel is different for holding the candle. But these ceramic mugs are super, super cute. And these candle sets on the Twisted Lily website retail for $75 each. Today's video shout out word is DIY. If you comment DIY down below in the comments first, you'll get a shout out in my next video. The next Next products that I got are some samples of fragrances and these are a few dollars on their website. So it's a pretty good deal if you wanna try out a fragrance and sample something before purchasing the full size. I ended up choosing two and I got by Memo Paris. This is the Moon Fever Eau de Parfum and it's a cute little thing that it's in. Some of the notes in this one are oil of bitter orange, oil of grapefruit, primo flori lemon. We've got neroli, clary sage, verbena, vetiver, leather, and tonka bean. Ooh, it smells really good. It smells really clean. I like this one. This one smells pretty good. I wish I had a little bit more citrusy in it. I'm very picky with some of my scents, you guys. But it smells really good. It smells nice. It definitely smells a little bit like florally, but it smells good. It smells fresh. The next product I've got is from Twisted Lily. This is the Mancera Cedra Boys Eau de Parfum. I'm gonna spray this on the other side. This one smells pretty good. This is fresh. It also has a little bit of musk to it. I like it. It's not super floral like the other one. This one though, it doesn't list the fragrant notes on here, but it was kind of similar to the other one. It looked like it had fresh notes and everything. So that's why I chose these two because I know it can be hard picking out fragrance online. So that's why it's always good to sample if you can. I think one of these was $5 and I think the other was $6, I believe. So not too bad. And I also got from the company a cute little pamphlet in here. If you purchase fragrances, it lets you help like keep track of them. So you can list the fragrance name and then if you love it, still thinking about it or if it's not for you in case you want to sample a bunch of fragrances just so you're able to keep track of everything and then when you're ready to buy they send you 15% off to your email address that you purchased from 
which may or may not change. I think this is great. And you're also able to rip these off and pull them off. Say like you put the ones that you don't like towards the bottom, you can kind of like subtract them as you go. And then once you find the ones you like, you can check out and get what you love. What did you guys think of these products? I don't know about you guys, but I am literally obsessed with candles. So I had to get some. And I love these kits, like DIY kits. I love DIY stuff. If you guys like DIY stuff, let me know down below. But I think it's so fun to do it yourself. And sometimes you can actually save money by doing it that way. And it's a cool, fun experience as well. Let me know what your favorite product was from my haul today. Today's video shout out goes out to Stacey Richardson. Thank you so much for watching my videos. If you guys want a shout out in my videos, make sure to watch the entire video and look out for the shout out word. And thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys haven't, make sure to subscribe, hit that like button and turn your post notification bell on so you guys are updated every time I post a new video. Love you guys, bye.